Shemai guys and girls, Johnny VR with a big Doctor Who reveal that came today. Uh, and that is the reveal of Doctor Who, a new Doctor Who story called Time Lord Victorious. And it's been described as a multi-platform experience and an amazing epic. Uh, and it will be multi-platform. And I was reading this thinking that it looks like the amount of people that are in on this project, this sort of multi-platform story, is unbelievable. And here's what it says about the actual uh, release. Time Lord Victorious will tell a new and untold story set within the dark times at the start of the universe when even the Eternals were young. Like, and it's following several doctors across space and time as they defend their home planet from a terrible race. This is a story like no other. And they released this poster with um, Paul McGann, David Tennant and Christopher Eccleston on it, uh, as well as some Daleks and Ood and Rose Tyler. So it's interesting to see um, where they're going to go with this. The caption is they're fighting a whole new time war. Like, beginning of the universe stuff, that's that's pretty uh, insane. And it's, you know, it doesn't confirm whether these are the only Doctors that are going to be in it or not. Because um, there's uh, not much details yet, but they're expected to release more and more about it. But get a load of how many people are actually in on this. It says, launching over a 12-week period later this year, the story will be delivered by Penguin Random House, BBC Books, Titan Comics, Doctor Who magazine, Big Finish Productions, who do the uh, the audio dramas, BBC Audio, uh, Eagle Moss Hero Collector, which is an action figure company, Immersive Everywhere, Maze Theory, who developed the Doctor Who Edge of Time, the VR game that I played on our gaming channel, and Escape Hunt, who are the, um, the company that make the Doctor Who escape rooms, all working together to tell this tale through their own medium. And that's insane. Um, James Goss, who's apparently the producer of this, has said that BBC Studios' Doctor Who licenses have come together to tell an amazing epic, one that's full of monsters, fun and heart. And that's... this is insane. Like, to, for each of these companies to tell the story through their own medium, that's going to be unparalleled. Because if you think about it, Maze Theory is specifically a VR company that makes VR games. Maybe they wouldn't make a game as as long as The Edge of Time, but maybe they would do like a short mini game set within the world in VR or something like that. Or maybe maybe it would be a full-blown sequel or or another release, you know, who knows? But like, maybe we can expect more Doctor Who VR from Maze Theory set within Time Lord Victorious. Uh, an escape hunt, this group that does Doctor Who escape rooms. Maybe if you've seen that and you thought, ah, oh, it looks really cool, but I don't know whether I would um, I would do, you know, something like that, or maybe you would in the future. Why, why not try it now when it's part of a massive um, story that they're trying to tell? Why not go for that one first rather than the other Doctor Who ones? But Big Finish Productions, you know, they've already shown how much, you know, they can produce and the quality that they can produce, um, as well as all these comics and books, you know. And, you know, this reminds me of something. Uh, the Alien franchise tried to do this, um, like, maybe a year or two ago, um, and they had this tagline, read, watch, play, like a multi-platform thing. But I thought that was a very lackluster because the read was sort of like a, a set of comics, which you might expect. But the watch was just a, a, an alien isolation cutscene montage, basically. And the game was a handheld mobile game. But the fact that Maze Theory is getting involved with this, like, they don't do mobile games. Um... It says, all strands of the story unite into a mighty patchwork that ranges from one end of the universe to the next. There's more to be revealed, but the enthusiasm and ideas which the licensees have come up with are breathtaking. It's going to be such fun. So this sounds like some big event crossover that's happening over all these mediums. Um, possibly it's going to cost a lot if you're going to get um, everything, but it definitely looks like there's a lot of... Doctor Who content to look forward to. Like I'm, 
I can't wait to see what Maze Theory do. Like, I love The Edge of Time, and you can see my reaction to that playing on our gaming channel. But um, I really can't wait to see what they do, Big Finish do, you know, all the other comments and books that they're, they're planning to release to keep up with this narrative. Um, but that's that's crazy and if you look at like the poster it's got like david tennant in the time lord ceremony dress like that's insane and how are they going to bring back christopher eccleston and and rose it's like are the actual actors going to get in on this because if christopher eccleston comes in on this this is a massive you know thing where, where maybe he his is going to be like a book or something where he doesn't have to sort of be involved just his character but like Oh, there's definitely s some things going on here that's going to be, like, very, very cool. Very, very cool. Guys, I'll post a link to this in the description of this video. Have a read of it and leave a comment. Tell me what you think. Tell me, is this something you're interested in? Maybe you're interested in the books or the audio dramas uh, or something like that. Um, but let me know in the comments below. Uh, let's have a discussion about this. Um, that's the Doctor Who update, and uh, I'll see you next time. Bye.